welcome back to a new video. Today I am going to be doing a quick thrift haul of everything I thrifted while I was in LA, Los Angeles. <laughs> Yeah, I had some mixed feelings about their thrifting and their flea markets. I went to the Rose Bowl at the beginning of my trip, found pretty much nothing, didn't really like it. It was really overwhelming. Then I went to a regular thrift store. I think it was a super thrift, something like that, which I got a bunch of stuff at really cheap prices, but not really many brands or anything like that. And then lastly, I went to Silver Lake Flea Market, which was much more my speed. I was overwhelmed by how much I wanted everything. And all the sellers were very much like Depop sellers, like kind of vibe, my style, a lot of vintage, cute 90s pieces. So I definitely bought a lot there as well. The Silver Lake Flea, however, it wasn't like the cheapest prices. It wasn't like your regular thrift store prices, but it was a good in-between. Um, wasn't as expensive as some Depop, but probably from like 15 to 30 range for most of the pieces. So yeah, let's start off with what I got at the Rose Bowl. I got one pair of pants. I didn't try these on, unfortunately, so they don't fit, which kind of sucks. But these will be on my Depop if you guys are interested. Your vintage pair of low-waisted Miss 60 denim jeans. This is what the butt looks like. They have cute little fake pockets at the front, red stitching, and then they just go down and you have a little flare at the bottom, but generally pretty straight leg. They're a really great style of pants. They just do not look good on me. So I will be putting these on my Depop, but I did get these at the one little stand that I thought was like kind of my style at that flea market. Then moving on to Super Saver, Super Thrifts, something like that. I got a bunch of like more basic pieces. I first got this Chico's dress shirt. I thought this would be really cute for layering with a skirt or with some low waisted jeans with one button done up. I just got a bunch of pieces I wanted to have fun styling with. This was $4.99. Um, looks like this. You can see it kind of has some pinstripe pattern going on. Very about that. Then I got this bright green little dress blazer coat type vibe. And I also thought this would be fun to style. I just love this color. It's by Talbots, which is a brand I used to thrift all the time in here, or in Canada. But <clears throat> I like the silhouette of it. I have no idea. This is not something I would normally pick up, but I like the color and I like the challenge so I got her as well I'm gonna try and go super fast because like I mean I don't really have much to say about everything the next top I got at the super thrift was this banana republic slinky kind of top it's black it's just like shiny material um, it looks a little big but we'll see basically it's like a halter scrunches up here I think it's just gonna hang really nice with the open back situation it got going on. I don't know. I think it'll be a nice summer top. So I'm excited to style this and this one was three dollars. So yeah as you can tell the prices are a lot cheaper at like super thrifts, goodwill, things like that. So next I got these boots which are these little kitten heel black not fully knee length but like calf boots. They have this cute little detailing. Some of you I feel like will think these are gross. I really like boots like this. So I already have a black pair, but these ones are more vintage -y, So I got these, and these were super cheap too. I think these were $4. That's kind of crazy. They're definitely not the best quality, but I style these with like a skirt or dress. Um, I also like wearing these with pants too that have like a wide leg. So yeah. Another thing I got at the thrift store were these capris, these white cargo capris by Edge. These were $2. I mean, you really can't read prices like that. It's better. It's even better than like Canada prices. But yeah, they're really cute. I really want to get into capris, so I'm obsessed with these. I haven't tried these on, but I'm excited to style. I think they look really cute with this top, actually. So that might have to be a fit for the gram. If you're not already, follow me on Instagram. My Depop is here too. If you want to check out things that I'm selling, 
but yeah really excited about these next i got this long sleeve little thermal from gap this was five dollars I just loved the stripes. I actually think I want to crop this just a little tiny bit, just so it like I don't have to fold it or anything. Um, but I really love the colors on this, and I think this will just be nice to throw over anything. Um, just very chill vibes. And I love blue. So yeah, got this one. Then I got a flannel, which I love a good flannel in the fall time, and I love the colors on this one, and I really, really have one flannel that I like, and it was only $4, so I thought, why not? It's by the brand Structure. It's in a large, it's super cozy and soft. I just love this flannel pattern too. Just be gonna be good to throw over anything. So I'm very excited about this. And I think it's, I don't know, I love putting flannels with anything, even clashing them with different patterns. I think flannel is just a great piece. I just love them. The last top I have to show you from the Super Thrift is this jacket from Jones, New York. This was $5. It's just this light spring fall jacket. It kind of has a denim jacket look, but it's black and white pinstripe. It's in great condition. I thought this, again, would just be fun to style throw over a simple outfit on a chillier night. So yeah, I'm really excited about this. I can't believe the condition it's in. It's really, it's honestly spotless. I think she's really cute and I don't have anything like this. I also love pinstripe. I think it's a really classic pattern that goes with a lot. So I'm excited to style that. The last two things I got from the Super Thrift were two pairs of bottoms. First is this skirt by Truffaluke, oh, from Zara. It's just this little tweed, low-waisted mini skirt. I've been really into low-waisted skirts, so that's why I picked up this one. A little dressier. I just think this will be cute, styled properly. So yeah, and it has two little zips. I love this little short mini. This was $4. And then the last thing I have are these mud vintage little shorts. The little shorty shorts, low waisted shorts. Again, I haven't tried these on either, but I think these are gonna be really cute as well. These remind me of shorts I used to wear when I was little. They are in size 11, which I'm now realizing is definitely gonna be too big, but I'm kind of hoping they'll be like baggy. I'm hoping they'll still fit on my hips somehow. So that's what they look like, and the butt is super cute too with the pockets, and these were $4. So yeah, excited about those. All right, so now moving on to everything I got at the Silver Lake Flea, which is the best stuff in my opinion. I'm gonna start off with this vintage 90s top. There is, the tag is Charlotte Russe. Um, it's in a size large, but there's an adjustable little tie at the back so I can tighten the front, so I'm not really worried. I haven't tried like any of this on, so the try-ons are probably the first time I've tried these on. But it's this really pretty little floral pattern with the main color being red, blue, cream. I just think it's super pretty and such a statement. Really great for summer. And I love that silhouette of that top. I love the adjustment at the back as well. I think that is super important. Next, I picked up two t-shirts. This first one, it was like a two for 15 deal. So I just picked this one because I need to pick another one. It says Rogue Status. Um, it just has this woman on it. I don't know. It's not my favorite, but I think it'll be good for like sleeping or just like chilling or whatever, going to get coffee. It's just a cool t-shirt. I like the washed out look of it. Um, and yeah, t-shirt I actually wanted with this one, mainly for sleeping as well, but I just loved the wash of this blue. It's just this vintage like Hawaiian hibiscus flower print. It says Hanale Surf. So I think it's like, brand or something in Hawaii. But yeah, I absolutely love this. Love the graphic. There's a graphic on the back as well. I think this will just be a super fun to lounge in and just vibe by the pool, by wherever, you know, not that I have a pool, but you know, love that. Next I have another pair of capris. These are denim. These are by the brand Squeeze. I absolutely love the tag on these. Um, they're in a size five, six. I didn't try anything on either. I just kind of guessed. I think these will fit, but I wanted to try some denim capris as well, and I liked the raw cut on the hems and as well as the bottom. The buttons too have the logo on them, super cute. This is what the butt looks like. Super excited to style these. 
and I am happy that I have you know a few months left to wear those next I got this top which again is a fun pattern it's by the brand XI I don't know how to say that but it's like the spandexy stretchy material it looks like this has a super cool pattern on it I think this will look really cute with a skirt or some black pants yeah and I like the color and I don't know if you can see there's a little keyhole cut out right there I think it's super cute I love it so much it is an icon you know really cool like psychedelic kind of pattern going on here but yeah next I got this jersey which is definitely pretty cheap quality but I thought this could be cool to style I envisioned this with like a black mini skirt or a white mini skirt but I liked the jersey vibe it's literally by the brand vibe but it looks like this two different blues has the like mesh going on a little red piping but yeah this could look horrible or not it definitely needs like an iron or something but that was kind of just like on a whim so yeah next I got this metallic top by the brand laundry and i actually planned on wearing this backwards it's meant to go like this um and it ties in the front like that and then it kind of like cinches at the bottom so it kind of like sits nicely if you can imagine that but i'm actually planning on wearing it like this with the super high neck um, and the straps and then a little keyhole at the back that will be open if that makes sense but I just love the bronzy brown metallic sparkly vibe of this. I think this will be really cute with the tan. So I love this guy. All right, moving on. I got this piece, which is a lingerie dress type piece. I just thought this would be really cute again with a skirt underneath or some mini shorts because it does cinch very nicely at the waist and then it kind of has this flowy little skirt thing. Looks like a leotard, but. I think I'll pair this with a mini skirt, like a little black skirt. I love layering, so this is a fun piece. I thought it'd be fun to try this out with different things and see how it can layer and things like that. But yeah, I think it's really pretty and really cool. Next, I got this top, which I'm obsessed with, but now that I'm looking at it, it does look a little big, so I'm kind of worried, but I would literally take this in to get this like altered if it's too big because I'm so obsessed with it. It's like this cream and black striped halter neck the neck comes up like this ties around little tube top little ruching out there i just love the silhouette of this it definitely is going to be big and i kind of want it to fit like super tight so i'm gonna have to figure that out maybe i have to go take this in i have a couple things that need to get taken in so i might just do a trip and take everything in but i'm obsessed with that and i still got two skirts that are super similar i'm only going to keep one probably First one is by the brand LEI or Lay. Um, I really like this brand. It's this mini low waisted corduroy beige skirt. I really love corduroy and I don't have enough of it, but you will see I got a lot of it. <laughs> the next few things I have to show you are corduroy. But I'm obsessed with the skirt, love the color. I really have only been obsessed with one skirt I have. I posted it on my Instagram a million times. Yeah, uh, it's this green kind of cargo skirt. It fits just so perfectly, and this one I've actually tried on fits just like it, so I'm really happy about this. And excited to have a new skirt to pair with items. Then the next skirt I got looks pretty much the exact same, but it has all this lace trim, which my boyfriend honestly hated and thought to himself, ew, when he saw the lace trim and the lace on the bucket pockets. But I think this is going to be really cute and I think I'm going to make it really cute and pair it with the right things and I think it's going to be a vibe. I think this would even look really cute with this guy. So yeah, I'm obsessed with this and this is by the brand YMI. But yeah, it's basically the same idea, mini corduroy beige skirt. So I think I'm going to keep both for now. Last pair of pants I have to show you are these black corduroy pants which in hindsight, I kind of wish I tried on because I have no idea if these are going to fit or not, but they're like a straight wide leg. They look like they're going to fit nice, and I have nothing really like this, so I just thought, why not? So I got these. Um, there's no brand on them, unfortunately, but hopefully they fit well. I can pair them with a bunch of different stuff. And then the last thing I have to show you guys is this striped long sleeve by the brand Buggle Boy. 
I just think it reminds me of UNIF. I love the colors, I love everything. It's just a cute little layering piece. Um, this will be good for fall. So yeah, little quarter length sleeves. Um, yeah, I think this is adorable. And very me. I love strips, so yeah. Anyway, so that's everything I got while I was in LA. All the shopping I did was pretty much thrifting. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I love you guys all so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.